Mother is in the hospital, accused of trying to kill herself after stabbing her baby boy to death. It's an horrific crime that has left a neighborhood in southwest Detroit in shock. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell is live outside that apartment building where it happened. Hey, Kim, what have we learned about this little baby? Well, police tell us he is under one years old. The medical examiner's office tells us they are waiting for next of kin to come identify him officially. And people who lived in this apartment building where it happened, they say he seemed to be a sweet child. Neighbors say the mom who called 911 last night only moved in a short time ago. She had her son with her all the time. She, you know, she goes strolls through the neighborhood. They never imagined what police say happened inside her apartment at 25th and West Burner was possible. It's just really messed up, you know, that somebody could self inflict pain on their, on their own child. Police say the mom told the dispatcher she planned to kill herself and there were dead people in her apartment. When police arrived, they found her bleeding and her baby son inside her apartment. He was dead. They believe she stabbed him, killing him, then tried to kill herself. Neighbors heard first responders emotionally break down at the scene. This is something unnatural and uh, no one should have to see it. And we will be looking out for our people. Police say right now the mom is in custody in the hospital being treated for her wounds. She is expected to survive when she is well enough. If she recovers, she is expected to be charged with this crime. Reporting live in Detroit, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. Just a heartbreaker, Kim. Thank you so much.